Hello and welcome to a new topic why is linguistics considered science lecture 16 or in other words we can say is linguistics art or science let's discuss the first we should discuss the idea about what is art before we talk what linguistics is all about the word art may be referred to as an activity or as a product in both cases it is done by people it is performed by people it is orchestrated by people with a communicative and aesthetic purpose this is the literal interpretation of the word art now let's define what is art according to great thinkers and writers leo tolstoy in his work what is art he defined a medium for the transmission of feelings means art is something that helps you express your feelings your emotions your desires let's have another definition benedetto croce in his famous work aesthetics he explains art is an intuitive expression an expression which comes out naturally and spontaneously so what we come to know about art is that it is related to feelings emotions desires intuition and has nothing to do with logical interpretation of something okay now we continue our discussion now let's talk about what is science science is the pursuit and application of knowledge and understanding based on systematic methodology and evidence means science is something that must be systematic and must be based on certain methods and science must also prove what it is going to explain we continue some more ideas about science thomas henry huxley he explains he defines science as rigidly accurate in observation means science always sticks to observation in a factual manner in an accurate manner not in a spontaneous manner or in a way your feeling wants it to look at to look at according to thomas hobbes and he defines science is the knowledge and dependence of one fact upon another so science is all about facts all about truth all about the study of factual events happening around us so science is based on facts based on systematic methodology and based on evidence that is the point here so now we can see the difference between art and science art is related to your feelings your desires your emotions while science is related to facts certain methodology and evidence we need to prove something in a concrete manner in an objective manner that is the difference between art and science now let's talk about linguistics the word linguistics it is it is noun and can be divided into two branches the first can be termed as linguistic and it's an adjective pertaining to or belonging to language or languages so ling- the word linguistic talks about language not about anything else now we have s and the morpheme s in linguistics it refers to discipline of science and in that way linguistics is the subject in which we study language in a scientific manner that is the point here little interpretation of the word linguistics now our basic idea is that why is linguistics not considered art let's find out some reasons talk about this idea the first point is linguistics does not study language for aesthetic purpose the word aesthetic you know science of beauty art of beauty knowledge of beauty magnificence of beauty so linguistics does not look at language from the perspective of your aestheticism from the perspective of how you feel about language therefore we cannot say linguistics is art therefore linguistics is not considered art we continue it does not analyze elements of language emotionally no need to explain there is no element of emotion involved in the analysis or interpretation of linguistic element therefore we cannot consider it art we continue our discussion therefore linguistics is not an art okay now we continue we move forward to the discussion why is linguistics considered science linguistics can be understood as a science both in general and specific terms how let's talk about this in general term linguistics adopt scientific approach to the study of language so in more general term in more general way of explanation the very approach the linguists adopt to study language is scientific objective in a specific terms linguistics studies elements of language which are both objective and verifiable whatever elements of linguistics whatever elements of language a linguist is 
try to study he or she tries to study in an objective and verifiable manner something that can be verified and proved something that is not a matter of my own personal whims and thinking we have some more ideas about why is linguistics considered science not art like natural phenomena in the physical world language has a concrete shape and occurrence language too has concrete shape like alphabets language too happens in a way many other natural phenomena happen around us it is also god gifted in the way we speak language or in the way the same language is spoken in different ways by different persons in the same society we have some more ideas about as physicist or chemist takes materials and measures their weights densities etc to determine their nature the linguist studies the components of language observing the occurrence of speech sounds so like physicist like chemist and as they take materials and they measure and put on the weights and they try to measure their densities and so on in the same manner a linguist tries to study components of language he observes the occurrence of speech sounds in various different ways and tries to prove tries to verify what are the factors involving in producing certain speech sound therefore linguistics is considered science we continue with the same idea the next idea is language like other phenomena is objective because it is observable with the senses it can be heard with the ear it can be seen when the vocal organs are in movement so like many other natural phenomena as you observe in an objective manner you can verify you can talk logically about likewise elements of language can also be observed with the senses like when i speak something you hear and when i speak something my vocal organs come into contact with each other to produce an utterance that is the point here we have some more ideas observation leads to processes of classification and definition in many branches of knowledge when you observe something deeply it leads to the process of classifying something and defining something in science each observable phenomenon is to be given a precise explanation thus for example the chemist classifies the elements into metals and non metals a biologist classifies living things into plants and animals therefore in the same manner in the same way linguists observe the features of language or words belonging to a particular class based on similarity or difference with other sounds and words therefore or thus linguistics is an empirical science as it employs the same techniques and methods to study a language as a scientist uses to study a particular thing that is how linguistics is proved as science and therefore is often called as the scientific study of language that is basically the idea about why is linguistics considered science not art hope you understand the concept thank you and goodbye